U.S. nat gas futures faced early pressure on Monday as rising production and declining LNG feed gas demand overshadowed the impact of extremely hot weather. The recent start of operations for the Mountain Valley Pipeline on June 11 is expected to contribute to the rise in supplies, with the pipeline facilitating the transportation of up to 2 billion cubic feet per day of natural gas from West Virginia to Virginia. In addition, EQT, a major gas producer in the nation, has ramped up production in response to the higher prices observed in May. On the demand side, the forecast for hotter weather until the end of June is anticipated to drive up the consumption of natural gas by power generators for air conditioning purposes. A strong high-pressure system is set to dominate much of the southern and eastern U.S. this week, bringing temperatures from the upper 80s to the 100s. Chicago is forecasted to reach the mid-90s on Monday, while most East Coast cities will see temperatures in the 90s from Tuesday to Thursday. The image shows that the 15-day forecast by both American and European weather models is the hottest of the past 45 years, based on run total cooling degree days. Overall, the demand for natural gas is expected to be high. Despite the extremely hot weather forecast and high demand, the short-term outlook for natural gas futures remains bearish due to ample storage, rising production, and the MVP's operational status. However, the impending heatwave could provide some support for nat gas prices. The market is currently trading below its pivot at $2.90, suggesting further downside potential. Should the downside momentum increase then I think it's reasonable to expect a pullback into a longer-term support zone above the $2.70 level. Given the upward trend, watch for a technical bounce on the first test of the $2.80 support level. If it fails, I expect the $2.70 support level to attract more aggressive buyers, potentially leading to a recovery to the $2.90 pivot. Please like and comment to support the channel. See you in the next one.